Yum. Help. Are we there yet, Freddy? Almost. Sure is nice of your cousin Calico to teach us all about raising hogfish. She'll be glad for the help. It's hard to run a big ranch all by yourself. Will we get to wear 10-gallon hats? I think a 5-gallon hat is more your size. Come on, let's go. I'm at least 7 gallons, Freddy. Six and a half minimum. There's Cousin Calico's ranch. We're going to be ranchers soon. Hi, Cousin Calico. Oh, hello, Freddy. Howdy, Luther. We're ready to help out. Which way to the hogfish? Well, it seems we got a little problem there. See, my prize-winning hogfish herd is being rustled. Rustled? What does that mean? Somebody came and took them without asking. That's not right. No, it's not. And a hogfish requires proper care. I think they might be in real trouble. I just don't know what to do. Did you call the police? I think the sheriff's gone out of town. And I need to stay here at the ranch in case the hogfish get away and come home. Not to mention all the worrying I have to do. We'll help you, Cousin Calico. Luther and I will find the hogfish and catch those rustlers. Yeah! Thank you both. You'll be doing me a real good turn. Look, Freddy! A purple sea urchin! We're rich! who live here if they know anything about those rustlers. Customers! <clears throat> Hello and welcome to Just Buckles. I'm Nelson Toso. How can I help you today? I'm Freddy and this is Luther. And we're helping my cousin, Calico Catfish. Rustlers took all of her hogfish. <gasps> Rustlers? Well, I wouldn't know anything about that. Did you see this picture? It's my son, Half Nelson. He was real cute as a baby, don't you think? He has your forearms. It says, just buckle. What are these plans? Oh, those are the blueprints for the custom belt buckles I make. They feature a stylish arching metal back with a personalized letter on the front. Any letter the customer wants. I'll bet they look nice. Oh, they're very popular. Have you seen anything suspicious? 
rustlers? No, I wouldn't know a thing about that. I know the piano, and it knows me, but that's about it. Sorry. I can't help you out. That's okay. Thanks anyway. Look, Freddy. Maybe this is a clue. Meet at the Rusty Rustler at high tide. Memorize the combination and then eat this note. One, two, six. I'll bet the rustlers left this. I wonder why they didn't eat the note like it says. It probably tastes like paper. We'll hang on to it. That combination must be important. I'm looking for Finn Eastwood. You feel guppy? Well, do ya? The end. Scale Rider. I'm looking for Finn Eastwood. You feel guppy? Well, do ya? The end. Scale Rider. I'm looking for Finn Eastwood. You feel guppy? Well, do ya? The end. Scale Rider. I'm looking for Finn Eastwood. You feel guppy? Well, do ya?
Yeah. Hi, it's me. Listen, I want to talk to you about that note. Come on, let's check out that hatch. Okay. Meet at the Rusty Rustler at high tide. Memorize the combination and then eat this note. One, two, six. This shouldn't be too hard. We just have to punch in the combination. One. One. Two. One. Two. Three, four, five, six. <clears throat> we did it! It's open! Boy, I'll say! I guess the lock was the only thing holding the door on. Tom Sarnett, what's that racket? Someone's coming! Hurry! Aw, oh, fiddlesticks! The door came off again. Well, I guess I'll just have to sit here and stand guard. I wonder if they still called it standing guard if you're sitting down. That must be one of the rustlers. I hear the hogfish in there. Let's go, Luther. Hey, Freddy, can we eat this note now, like it says? Well, I guess we won't need the combination anymore. <laughs> well? I can see why the rustlers didn't eat it. It tasted like paper. sign of the hogfish? They're probably in there too, but we'll have to get inside to find out. It's rustlers only in the hideout. Oh, 
Oops, I didn't think I was supposed to say it was a hideout. We might be wrestlers. How do you know we're not wrestlers? That's easy. You're not dressed like wrestlers. If you were a wrestler, you'd have a 10-gallon hat like mine, a belt buckle like mine, and a fashionable bow tie. All wrestlers dress exactly alike? Yep. We all wear the latest wrestler gear. You can see from this picture in WrestleMania magazine. Hmm. An orange 10-gallon hat, a big old belt buckle with a K on it, and a bow tie. Since you're not wearing these things, you must not be wrestlers, so you can't come in. Because this hideout is for wrestlers only. Okay. Thank you. This is the wrestler hideout, all right. I'm sure the hogfish are inside. What are we going to do? We've got to get some new clothes. All right, you hogfish. Quiet down or else. Or else I'm calling Mr. Big. <gasps> Did you hear something? It was probably just the current. I guess. I guess whoever was working here is done now. You two look like you've got trouble. <laughs> you can say that again. We made this floor for the big square dance tomorrow. Only we found out it has to be, well, square. And we are out of wood. We need some more to start over. A piece about five feet by five feet ought to do it. Good evening, ma'am. Sir, allow me to introduce myself. My name is Gil Barker, and I represent the Biloxi Premium Gum and Wheel Nut Company, third largest distributor of bubble gum and wheel nuts in the Upper Western Hemisphere. I'm Freddy Fish, and this is my pal Luther. My employers have authorized me to clear out my inventory to make room for next year's models. Everything must go. Therefore, I, Gil Barker, We'll be offering you prices so outrageously low that you'll have to bend over to see them. Great. Friendly reminder to Gil Barker. You owe Shady Shark 20 clams. Pay up pronto. What's this? Oh, that's, uh... That's nothing. It's a poem I was writing. That's an awfully strange poem. Did you used to work at a carnival? And a fine job it was. But I came out west to, uh, to explore new opportunities. Oh. Wheel nuts are a growth industry. I... Do you know anything about any rustlers in the area? Rustlers? <clears throat> no, I wouldn't know anything about that.
do it. Oh, boy! I see another purple sea urchin. It's a crank handle. What's it doing here all by itself? Shouldn't it be attached to something? Yeah, I doubt it belongs in this cave. I wonder how it got in here anyway. Good question. Gee, Luther, you're about the best friend a fish could have. Ah, thanks. I'm a little tied up right now. Watch this, Freddy. I learned all about knots in the Fish Scouts. Um... Sheriff Zachariah Shrimp is in your deck. If there's ever anything you need, why, you just ask. Well, as a matter of fact, there are some rustlers who... But I must be off. There's law breaking afoot somewhere. I can smell it. But... You there! No loitering! <clears throat> uh, Freddy! What? Oh, I'm sorry, Luther. <laughs> wow, that's amazing! I was in Fish Scouts, too.
another purple sea urchin. Boy, somebody's been leaving these all over the place. Hey, that sail is keeping the water from coming down here. Hey, that sail is keeping the water from coming down here. belong somewhere. container of pepper. Alright. What about cake? Will you eat cake? Here, try it. But it's chocolate. Yeah, I, 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 